What's happening? Uh, we're headed into another shed video. Welcome back. Uh, we went out last weekend and we didn't pick up anything. So I picked up one antler and that was a super old nasty chalk that I found on, on the way out off the road. I think somebody had dumped it off the road. But anyway, so that's what we're doing today. Stay tuned. We're going to go pick up some elk sheds. So meeting up with Jake again today. Yeah, so we're going to go uh, check some stuff out. Um, today's kind of special because today is going to be the first video that I make on the new camera. Um, I picked up a Nikon D5500, a DSLR camera. I'm pretty excited about the camera. We're fixing to uh, hopefully make some really high quality stuff coming down the pipe. So, yeah. So uh, stay tuned. We're going to go pick up some elk sheds. See you in a bit. Jake's already out here picking up roadies. Look at that freaking stud. Pork white, baby. Heck yeah, dude. Another dash horn. Another dash horn. <laughs> Getting her started early. Heck yeah. Little, little mule deer horn. Right. Love it. Love these little tiny horns. They're cool. Hell yeah. Dash horn. Bam. Perfect. Right. Sweet. Let's go find some more. Good start. Good start. Well, driving down and Jake got another one. He didn't think it was an antler at first, but it's a uh, it's an antler. That thing's been laying here for a while. There's some antlers in here. There's always been a few. Right on. Yeah. Oh. Stock chuckers. All right. Well, we'll have to come walk in here for a little bit, I guess, huh? That's a good one. Not a bad horn at all. Just a one, two, three, four, five. Well, he's got a funky little thing going on here. It might be two years old, but he's a heavy horn little guy. Decent bass. That looks like it hurt. Heck yeah. Finally. Got a good one. Sweet. We're gonna, we got some horns to find in here, and that's for dang sure. So we'll keep on keep on going in here. There's definitely some horns to be found. So stay tuned. We got some more coming. Well, just picked up this little whitetail shed. Walked right up on it. Was well, gonna be mine. Oh, might have been. Mine I got to it first though. Heck yeah. <laughs> Not bad. Almost fit in your pocket. Pocket horns. Yep. So, sweet. Well, I'm on the board for deer sheds. So, Jake found that little, I think it might be two years old, but I think it's hard white. <laughs> so, heck yeah. Heck yeah. We're on them. Find some more. All right. Once again, I got another horn. Two horns. So this is a pretty rare one. 
I got one mule deer horn. I go check it out, look at it. And then I got right here and I looked over. And there's a freaking elk horn here with it. How cool is that? Got my sticks here. <sighs> my sissy sticks. Heck yeah. That is freaking sweet. Not bad mealy horn. Chalker. Chalkish. Heck yeah, though. It's a nice horn. Take that. Let's see what we got over here with the old elk horn. It's a cool horn. Bladed out top. Looks just like the horn Morgan found this morning. He's that same five point top. I think it's the same bill with different ears. I don't know. Weird. Heck yeah, that's cool. Often, that you can find a mule deer horn and an elk horn together. Pretty cool. Alright, well, I'll get back with you later when I find more horns. Well, I'm freaking pumped. But, Morgan's not happy with me. I have found a fair amount of good big coos deer heads between the high 90s and over 100. I haven't walked up to look at it yet because, yeah, I just get too excited and then I just lose my mind. And I'm like, ah, gotta spin circles like a freaking psycho. But, here we go. Oh man, not sure what I got here. What the heck is that? What? Look at those freaking horns! That? Oh my god. Oh, wow, look at that. And ain't no 100 incher, but. <laughs> you can't see my face. <laughs> Ooh, I love this. Dude, that is freaking cool. Wow. Look at that thing. What the heck? Whoa. Man. Alright. Well, since Morgan mad at me, I'm just gonna sit here and grin and smile over this thing. What in the Freaking heck. <laughs> that is freaking so cool. Wow. That broke point there. That is definitely the most unique coos deer head I've ever found. Gosh dang it, I wish this wasn't broken. Ow. Freaking rocks. Check this thing. Cool that is. Got that rope point there. It's too bad. I wish that thing was there. That'll, that'll put the icing on the cake with this thing. Look at this. What the heck? Gosh, that's so freaking cool. It's a heavy little sucker too. Too bad he didn't have a better side than a two point to match it like yeah let's go find some more all right well I got another white tail shed I got to <laughs> literally right here before I seen it and uh, there it is so sweet Jake's picking up the, all the elk sheds. Found a decent mule deer shed, I guess. But, oh my god, that thing is ancient. It's falling apart in my hand, but... Ain't bad. 
Not a bad one. So. Alright. I'll take it. I guess. So. Yeah, that's super chalky. <laughs> Alright. Well. Right on. There's some antlers in here. Keep on trucking through this country. The last white tail shed I found was in this grassy open stuff too, so we'll just keep on going. Hopefully find something a little fresher. So Alright. Keep on moving. Well we're just in here taking a break. And old Jake does it again. Swiping swiping up some dirty coos deer heads. He does it again. That's a good one. I don't even, I mean, what even is that? That's just ridiculous. So, yeah. So he's got a pack full. It's too bad, because he broke something off there. I'd really like to have seen that. Oh well. Yep. Cool buck. Definitely one of the coolest ones I've got. Besides the big ones. Definitely character. He's not a real big scorer, but. No. Character wise, yeah. Yep. And then I got my two. Tiny little white tail sheds. <laughs> and Jake's got all the elk horns. Oh, and a mule deer horn. Yeah, I do got a mule deer horn. It's a pretty cool one. The mule deer horn. I mean, I was walking over to go look for the mule, look at the mule deer horn. I looked over and this white five point I was laying there with it. That was cool. I took a little video of that. So, yeah. Right on. Well. That'll probably be the cover of this video. That coos deer head right there. So, yeah. So, anyways. We're gonna keep on moving along here. I don't know what we're gonna do from here. There's still a lot of country to hit right in here, but. A heck of a lot. I mean, we haven't even really touched it. I know there's a bunch of elk sheds in here, but just got to do zigzags and keep on walking it, so. <sighs> yeah, we'll see what happens. We'll just keep on moving. So, yeah. That's the update. These rocks suck. Yeah, I'm pretty tired of walking over them myself. <sighs> oh, we made it back to the truck. <clears throat> Jake's got a pack full, and I don't. So imagine that. There's that coos head again. Heck yeah, pretty good load. So yeah, that's a super cool buck. Right on. Day's not over. Not yet. Ain't over yet. So, yeah, we'll get back with you here in a little while. See what else we can find. Well, made a last ditch effort to come in and I stopped right at this tank over here on the way out. And I picked up that little broken piece right there and then uh, stumbled on little deer horn little three-point deer horn so heck yeah take that for a last-ditch effort so heck yeah not bad hard white heck yeah good deal I'll take it 
Right on. Alrighty. Well, that just about wraps up the day. So, did, we did alright today. Um, Jake picked up quite a few uh, elk, elk horns. Um, he, I think he picked up six, maybe. Um, that white tail head. And then a mule deer shed. Uh, two mule deer sheds, that white tail head. A few elk horns. And then uh, he matched one bull up. A little raggy type of bull and then uh, we never did match up my big my big five point or six point I guess is what he is but so we never did match him up but eh, he's right there somewhere I'm I know but there's uh there's definitely a lot of bulls in here and uh, I've said it before but I'm excited to go back in here here in a couple months so looks like Jake's just getting back here Empty-handed. Empty-handed. Boo-hoo. So that, that deer horn I just picked up is not the other side. It's the, oh. same, it's the same side, same year, hard white, but it is uh, bigger. <laughs> oh, bigger. Yep. Bigger is always better. So, yeah. So anyways, uh, we're going to go ahead and jet out of here and, yeah, catch you guys on the next one. Woo. See ya. Heck yeah. Nice.